Hello everyone, uh, my name is Stefano and uh, before I came to Balance View uh, I had a pretty good life. Uh, in fact I could say I had a blessed life. Everything, everything was uh, was nice and sweet. Um, my family has always supported me in, in pretty much every possible way. And uh, I noticed uh, early on I started learning uh, things that would make me feel good and things that would make me feel bad. Uh, how to look for things that make me feel good and how to avoid things that make me feel bad. And, uh, and I managed to put in place uh, pretty successful strategies. Uh, uh, after, uh, and after many years, basically, I was living from a very, very limited box, you could say. I had collected so many notions of, of things that uh, I should look for and things I should avoid. And, and I, felt, I felt very limited. I said, my God, this is... Uh, <laughs> I can't do this, I can't do that, and I need to constantly look for this and that. And so I started uh, engaging in a series of uh, spiritual practices, personal growth uh, courses, etc. And, uh, and it was great. Um, I, I had many insights, many realizations, and um, I was introduced also uh, to open intelligence um, in some ways before, and but what was missing is I wasn't able to uh, to actually live what I had come to know. It was I had constantly to to be on a course or to do to to uh, constantly do a specific practice, and basically I couldn't live life. I was busy and and making sure that everything was okay. So about two and a half years ago, I arrived to Balance View, and uh, well, uh, since I had been, I had been on a search and uh, trying all these strategies for a very long time, um, I said, okay, you know, let's give it a go. It's another one. I've got not, nothing to lose, uh, and let's check it out. Um, in the last two and a half years, I have been involved in the four mainstays every day, every single day. And uh, yeah, I was, I was lucky that I was open enough to say, let's really check it out. I loved in today's talk when Candace said in the beginning, you have to take it easy. And uh, that's really what I had to do, to take it easy. Uh, I had plenty of ideas, I know it all, oh, it's, uh, I'll, I'll be the one to never get it. Uh, and, you know, it just, uh, it was very frustrating at times because uh, uh, everything's, everyone seems so amazing, so shining, so happy, and uh, I still got all of these afflictions, all these things that I don't want, I mean. And uh, it's really, the, the Four Mainstays uh, is really an incredible, an incredible infrastructure, I would say. It's really, it creates an incredible synergy. The Four Mainstays, uh, uh, the trainer, the training, short moments of open intelligence and the community. In every single moment, I am uh, completely uh, supported uh, in, in recognizing my own true nature, my own indestructible stability. And with time, eventually, after two and a half years, I, I can say that it, many of the things that I hear the trainers in Kansas speaking about, they have become my own experience in, in day-to-day life. Um, it's incredible to uh, to really in, in the most in the most afflictive states uh, to really really allow it to be as it is was uh, pretty good today uh, coming here 
and waiting for the generator uh, to go on. <laughs> a few minutes of silence, they could have felt like 50 years. <laughs> so, yeah, and really, really to be able to relax. And, and it, took me, it took me time to, uh, to really in instinctively know in my experience what it means to really allow what it, what it is uh, to be and because even in the beginning you know okay let's take a short moment wait a minute what is a short moment uh, okay I need to stop thinking for a minute but okay I'm stuck am I stopping thinking is there any <laughs> thought there <laughs> you know <laughs> so <laughs> and and you know, it just uh, being being immersed in the four mainstays. You know, you have incredible texts. I mean, the profundity of the text, uh, uh, the training media, uh, the the trainers sharing the, their direct experience, uh, and the community reflecting back, uh, basically uh, perfection in every moment. Uh, it's just incredible. And slowly, slowly, I have really come to see in in. In my own experience, uh, this is it. This is it. I can recognize this in my own experience. So nothing really changed. You know, I still have the same uh, afflictive states that I had before. But the difference is, uh, I don't waste any time in in these afflictive states. You know, everything still com comes up. The difference is just that there's no. There's no need, there's no wish uh, to, uh, to fiddle around with perceptions. Um, and it's just incredible to, to allow the flow of, of, of the energy of open intelligence to, to arise and rage freely. There is an incredible openness and, which has uh, transformed the way I relate with people. There is a total, total openness and relaxation in every moment. An ability to really be totally with myself and with this, an ability to totally be with everyone. Like in this very moment, to be with all of you in an incredible way. Totally open-hearted, nothing to guard, nothing to defend. <coughs> and. Uh, and you know, uh, I could do anything in life. I, I, there is nothing, nothing limits me anymore. And uh, and what else? What is what else is left? And for me, uh, I just want to. After after experiencing what it is uh, to be with this incredible community, I there's simply a wish to to contribute back, and just. Uh, um, share this, have an incredible life together, work on amazing projects together. Uh, this is also one of the incredible advantages of spending time with the community, really expressing my gifts and talents uh, um, in an amazing way, all working together in total harmony in the midst of all perceptions. Wow, it's quite quite a remarkable life.